Concert venues also kind of stuck in limbo these days. The governor is saying that we're not going to see any concerts here in California until at least 2021. And as Christine Lazar reports, many ticket holders scrambling to get refunds and say they are being stonewalled in the process. Veronica Brown is a high school principal and a huge Janet Jackson fan. So when Jackson announced her world tour was coming to Staples Center in August, Brown purchased four tickets the day they went on sale in February. The price? More than $1,800. Then the pandemic hit, and the governor announced no concerts would likely happen before 2021. So in April, Brown tried to contact the website where she purchased the tickets, ticketcenter.com. And I would call and call and call, and then I started emailing, no response. Carlvetta MacGyver purchased four tickets to see Paw Patrol live in May with her niece and nephew. But instead of offering a refund, the company where she purchased the tickets, AXS, sent her this email telling her the show had been rescheduled for March 2021. The tickets were $100 each. I bought six tickets. Um, I clearly explained my position that I was self-employed. I needed the cash. MacGyver was told in that same email that if she no longer wanted the tickets, she could try to resell them. The right thing to do by consumers, uh, given the unprecedented number of cancellations we've seen, is to give them their money back. John Breo is with the National Consumers League, one of the many consumer groups pushing for ticket sales companies to refund consumers' money during this pandemic and not to force them to wait for shows to be rescheduled. Basically, these companies are asking consumers to do is to give them a no-interest, long-term loan with some expectation that the service is gonna be provided at some point in the future. Ticket giant Ticketmaster and its parent company Live Nation recently updated its policy after backlash from consumers. For canceled shows, refunds will be automatically processed. For rescheduled and postponed shows, ticket holders will have a 30-day window to request a refund. That was Christine Lazar reporting. Carvette McIver ended up getting another email from ticket vendor AXS telling her she could put in a request for a refund after all.